Hi, I'm Bruce Grant, the ORF doctor, and today I'd like to show you how to repair a resonator box when the nail has chipped out the particle board. This, com this is commonly on Suzuki's that this happens because they're one of the manufacturers that use particle board. So to start with, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to just mark where the nail was so that after I put on the glue I can still see where the nail goes so I don't move the bar side to side. Okay. Now I've put a block in just a plastic bag and this is just so that I can put glue there without it going everywhere and I'm just going to clamp this on. And I just got the block, I've got the block flush with the top of the resonator box. Okay. So that I'm going to fill that cavity with epoxy. So I'm going to squirt out enough epoxy to fill that cavity. Mix it up. And before I get all over the place, Just work it into the hole a little bit. And scrape off the excess. Now that needs to sit for about 10 minutes to cure. So once it's set, we'll be back. So now we're back. The glue has set. I'm going to take the clamps off and gently remove the plastic. Like that. Okay. Now I'm going to drill a pilot hole to put the nail in because If you don't drill a pilot hole, what will happen is the nail will break out the glue. And then since this is typically on a Suzuki, this is a Suzuki nail, just before on chipboard I always put hot glue in the hole. Just to help fasten. And then just gently nail in and let it all set up. So. That's how you repair when the resonator box has been broken. Once this glue is set up permanently, it should hold it in. There you go. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to contact me through my Facebook page, The Orf Doctor. Have a good day.